In other news tonight, a 51-year-old Cape Breton man is in police custody after he nearly demolished a house in North Sydney with a front-end loader this morning. Neighbors say they awoke to a loud bang in a scene right out of a movie. Here's CTV's Kyle Moore. They cracked the pole off, the sparks are flying everywhere. It was an early morning wake-up call like no other. This front-end loader used to knock down a power pole, ripping it from the ground. The machine was then used to barrel through this North Sydney home. All of it witnessed by neighbor Gary Standing. So I looked at the bedroom window and next thing you know, I mean, he was ramming at the pole, ramming at the pole. And I said, oh my gosh, he's doing this on purpose. And then he turned around and he just went straight through the side of the house. Standing immediately called 911, fearing for his life. Shortly after the tractor left the scene, it was spotted by officers a few kilometers away. But police say the driver refused to stop, slamming the machine into a concrete barrier in front of this liquor store. And at that time, officers were able to uh, approach the man, convince him to come out of the machine and place him under arrest. And how old was he? 51 years old. He's a Sydney resident. Cape Breton Regional Police say all of this happened just before 5 a.m. this morning. There was nobody home at the time and there were no injuries. Police also say the driver of the loader and the homeowner are known to each other. Well, I can say that's the first time I've heard of something like this happening and I've been working here for 10 years, so this is a pretty rare occurrence for us. And uh, in this case is a very isolated incident as the individuals involved are known to each other. Power was shut off in the neighborhood and the road closed while crews made repairs. Standing says it was a wake up call he'll never forget. Crazy. Like I say, it's just uh, I, I never seen anything like that in my life. Like I say, it was pretty scary for my wife and I like because you don't know if he's going to Turn around, come, you know, do all the houses in the neighborhood, right? So police would not say where the loader came from or if it was stolen. Only adding their investigation is continuing and charges are pending. Now, police say we can't expect to see charges laid this evening or tomorrow morning. They do have 24 hours after the arrest is made to make them. Meanwhile, security remains on scene at the home on Seaview Drive in North Sydney tonight, Bruce. Wild story. Thanks for that, Kyle. You're welcome. CTV's Kyle Moore reporting live tonight from Sydney.